Welcome to another episode of No Rules. This is kind of an intervention, I reckon. We'll see how this ends up. But I am not happy with a certain somebody that has become a close friend of mine walking around like something strapped to his leg and a crutch. <laughs> now, T, uh, I was sad. When, when he walked into the field the other day, I was sad. Because I was thinking, wow, he actually didn't hit the stairs. And you know what he said to me? He said, I said, bro, like, seriously, was the stairs closed? He said, look, it was the 30th minute, so I was cool. But if it was the 70th, then maybe. It's Jordy, innit? Straight after a banging live show that I was at where I nearly punched up security. <laughs> yeah, I heard about that, man. Can I just point out something? I asked Bex to bring me a big bottle of Evian. He bought himself a 500 milliliter bottle of Evian That's right, and bought nine. a six pack of 1.5 litre bottles of Evian. You know why, <laughs> No. I asked the man, I said, boss, can I, can I just get one bottle of you know, Evian water? He said, yeah, it's down there. But obviously there's six and they all got the seatbelts on. <laughs> so I'm saying, you know what, I'm not taking those seatbelts off. So I'm, I've walked back to where this is yeah. and I've looked at the bottom shelf. Yeah? I can't see no big Evian bo water bottle because you said Evian. So I went back and said, boss, I just need one of these. He said, yeah, down there. <laughs> see, but again, I said, you know what, boss? <laughs> I'm just all of it. He said, tenner. I said, yeah, yeah. Merry Christmas to you. Made it, you didn't That's a not a tenner. 7.99 plus my, plus the stuff that I bought for myself. So it's a tenner. Oh, okay. Yeah, it's oh, a tenner. Cool. Everything's a tenner. That's it, everything's a tenner. Um, Jordy, before we get into your trials and tribulations, yeah. I just want to hear a story about going into um, a black hair shop last week. <laughs> 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 By the way, guys, you're no good, rules show. You're good at this, you know. No rules show. <laughs> um, if you're new to the channel, subscribe. If you've never subscribed, subscribe. But also, we're on Spotify. We want to grow on Spotify. We want you to subscribe there. We want you to listen there. Um, so yeah, search us on Spotify, No Rules Show, Spex Gonzalez. Um, it's a great audio experience when Spex knows how to talk into the mic. Sometimes he doesn't. Okay. But Spex, talk to me about going into a black hair shop on Friday. Yeah, so I was paying for manager in my house, having a great morning. Podolsky interrupts me, slide tackles, comes out of nowhere and says, can you go to the hair shop and get the kids some hair cream? And I hate this stuff. I don't care about the kids' hair cream and stuff like that. I don't care. <laughs> if it was my just, way. You could have just ended, I don't care about the kids. The kids. No, oh, sorry, sorry. Yeah, I could, obviously, it's that as well. Yeah. So I'm like, oh my God, I've got to go all the way, you know where I am. I've got to go all the way to Tottenham to get this because there's no pack where I am in Burnley. There's no pack. We know that already. There's definitely one closer though. I walk into the shop now. Bear in mind, boys, this is where I've decided that I'm going to revamp myself and start putting, you know, cream in my hair. Have you noticed I've creamed my face today? No. I put a little show on. So I'm looking after myself anyway. I know it's your trousers though. No, those trousers are okay. They, yeah. This the t-shirt they came with. Oh. Yeah. Just ordered another set by the way. Anyway, okay. Coming soon. Different color though, please. Yeah, black. Good, I, I, think, I think it'll look all right in black. Oh, thank I you. don't have a problem with it. I think you got the color wrong, but I think the trousers, Jordy doesn't like them, I think they're good. Is it? T, honestly I respect you because you've never ever given me up any condoms for anything this year. You're, you're an autumn guy. I feel like you dress okay in autumn. What? Yeah, browns. <laughs> I only dress okay in November, October, <laughs> September. Oh, you dress shocking <laughs> in the summer. And in the winter, you wear, you wear your giant Arsenal coat with any woolly hat. Yeah, you look shocking. How's the hair now? Because I put, I put cream on his hair. It's, it's, it's good, it's fake, but it's good. It looks fake, isn't it? No, I know it is. Okay, so basically I've gone and bought myself some new hair cream along with the kids. Yeah, I got the adult version, I got the kids version, of course. So I'm in a queue, there's a big queue, and obviously it packs for some reason, you know, it's owned by Asians, but a lot of, you know, Africans and Caribbeans in there. Cool. There's so no, I'm in, and I don't need to dwell on that. No, but I, I do like it in there though. Yeah. I do like it in there, because <laughs> yeah. every cream bottle's touching. <laughs> yeah. There's no- they, The way they stack the shelf. <laughs> the way they stack the shelf. They stack them to the top. Yeah. No one can reach yeah, them, but yeah. they're up there. Bro. There's no space. And then behind the till, there's like wigs. It looks like a stadium of wigs. Like, I like the shop, you know what I mean? It's not, it's not like a shop, it's like someone's house. <laughs> Whenever you go through them, you look at the creams. There's so many different <laughs> versions of the same cream. I look at this, I don't know how people know which one's the good yeah, one. I don't understand. Everything's here. Uh, so I'm in a queue now. And obviously, you know, when you're queuing behind Africans and Caribbeans, it's not, never a queue in it. Because obviously people stand beside you. So you've always got to step <laughs> forward to show yeah. that you're in front. I can't stand yeah, people so who can't queue. But go so on. I'm not happy. But there's a guy, Kenwin Jones. I'm never forgetting. He's, he's in front of me. He's got the locks that go back and then a ponytail. So the, this part is just terrible. <laughs> but I've got to see this behind me. 
So Cameron Jones in front of me, I'm standing behind him now. And he's talking, he's looking for oud. They've got a box of all these little ouds, yeah? So he's looking, 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 looking. I'm like, all right, cool. He turns around and says, boss, what do you think of this? T touches my nose. Like, English accent. Huh? I can't remember. I think I muted him anyway, just because, yeah, I muted him. But, smell it, I said, yeah, but it's nice. I didn't care about the smell, just bite, because I want to, I want to get out of here. Yeah, he's dead, it's a good 15, 20 minutes, he's still there. I'm like, oh, 15, mate, 20 minutes? He's dead, tea, he's, like, he's, like, people are moaning, people are kissing their teeth. 20 minutes of kissing teeth. Anyway, he walks off now. So he walks, gets out, I'm like, yes, it's my turn. So I've given the hair cream, whatever called. Remember, I haven't checked prices, yeah? But I know it's expensive. Five ninety nine, six ninety nine. that's usually the price of cream. He's giving the, 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 the car machine. I see 31 pounds, I'm thinking, obviously a lie, so I know he's got a critical situation. <laughs> stuff, yeah? That's a lot of cream. It's, yeah, you know what I mean? And you know, I know we're critical. When you went to packs back in the day, the price tag is different, you know what I mean? It, it, it connects to all the other creams. You know what I mean? 1,600, seven. It just keeps going, <laughs> point 0.99 in the back of the shop. <laughs> so there's no point checking the price. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm saying 31 pound, I'm thinking, nah, 31 pound. Nah, nah, no way, so, but they give you a little receipt, innit? So I'm looking, I see the oud, the oud, the, the, the oud that the guy was buying in front of me, then I realised, oh, hold on, the guy who left, his car declined, but what he done, he touched it, and bop, kicked out. Nice, when he turned right, right, Gone. But them man are cheeky. Who are the Asians? Yeah. Why? Because they added it onto yours. That's shocking, yeah. But, but he you must know have why? said, my boy's paying for it. But you, yeah, no, he didn't. Maybe. But, but I think it's because he asked me to smell it. Right. And I, we exchanged there, so it looked like we were together. That's bad business if they took that to mean he's paying. Oh, that's an agreement. That's a contract. But I hear it, though. Darren Ben's standing behind Cameron Jones. Yeah. Like, I hear it. He's just going to be like, oh, they know each other. <laughs> okay. Cool. It's racist. So, yeah, it does not lose. Because so, there's there were only Darren Benson and Kenwin Jones <laughs> in that shop. I think they charged, they surely have charged the people behind me as well. <laughs> Everyone got a bottle. So now I'm like, now, you know me, I, I'm, I, I come from a, a, a heart of kindness and humanity. Sometimes I feel like just buying everyone something in the shop. This is, I just feel like that. Well, yeah, I asked you for an Evia and you bought me a six pack. Yeah, so that's kindness and humanity. That's true, yeah. that, that's true. That's true, sometimes, right? Sometimes you pay for everything. So when I saw the Ood, I'm thinking, you know what, I don't like when the guy, Kim and Joe, just kicked out the shop. You know what I mean? Yeah. But let me just pay for it and go about my business. But £31 is going to come out of my account. And you are cheap. So if I've got £100, £69 is going to be showing. It's good maths. That's bad. So I'm like, no, 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 but I'm the boss. So he's, now this is what I don't like. So now when he's looking at the receipt now, he's, this is where the acting starts coming. Mm. <laughs> now I'm annoyed because I, he tried to kind of get me. Yeah. So he's like, oh. So uh, is he your friend? So he knew what he was doing. Yeah, now, now I'm mad. Boss, put my money back. He's told me he's gonna take three to five working days. So I left that oud, uh, pack, whatever you wanna call it. And I went all the way to um, country. I went to Curry's. And I chilled in Curry's for a bit. I bought myself a, a, a hard drive and all this. I was messing around. What? Yeah. So three hours he later. Loves hard drives. I bought a hard drive. I love buying Rams and all that stuff. Uncle Rams will tell you. <laughs> so I've got a hard drive in my kitchen that I don't need. Now I'm thinking about taking a 65 pound. Two terabyte. Two terabyte, you know? 65 pound. Yeah. But uh, Luma said to me, oh, you bought a Toshiba and you should have bought um, Lamers or something. Because if you, br if you drop this one, it damages. Now, nah, I want my money back. You wanted the, or the orange thing, yeah. Yeah, yeah. but boys, guess what? Curry's is not a good place to buy. Like. I'm in Curry's, and I'm, I'm, I'm looking at hard drives, but I can still smell oud. So I'm thinking, what, hard drives smell of no oud? No way. The oud was still, so, I'm, so now I've realized Pax sell the proper oud. So Chunks and all those guys who were smelling the oud, they go to Pax. They told me four bills and sausages. It's really <laughs> 6 in, 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 in Pax. So guess what, boys? I'm going there straight after this to buy that same oud. Are you crazy? <laughs> I never knew 69 who can stay on your nose for six hours. A lot of the time though, that stuff is like Ood, petrol. It, it could get annoying. What? Ood could get annoying, yeah. man. What do you mean like, petrol? You know, cheap ood, it's like, it's a punch in the face every time it, ah. You ever got in a, you ever got in a car with someone who's got cheap ood on? Ood oh can, my God, who is it? Ood can get annoying. Is it? No, but this ood was nice though. Cause they showed me some other, like, you know, other ood's. 
Yeah. <laughs> this story's mixed. What? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. You so, you looked at more oots. I know. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You deserve you deserve to pay this money. <laughs> they showed me some other oots. Yeah, yeah. I didn't want to put that part in, but yeah, they showed me some oots. So it was on my mind. But that particular oot that he bought and ran off with makes sense. I'm I've got my running trainers on now. <laughs> That same oud I want to take. But you're a you're you're a Dior Sauvage man, and you should you, no, you, you need to graduate. It's yeah, time. I, you told me that already. You yeah, don't have you my need feelings. to graduate. It's time. I hate that. I hate that. I was in um, Selfridges with him, and he's arguing with a guy about why he shouldn't buy a new aftershave. Sauvage isn't. It's it's, it's good though because it's not expensive. Is it? Well, excuse me. One hundred and seventy-nine pounds. That's not expensive. How much did you buy? He bought a big bowl. Two two ten. The big bowl. Two hundred ten milliliters. Yeah, because it has to last. I think that's about where you bought it from then, because Dior Sauvage is not that expensive. 150. And this is the worst. Because when, 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 when you spray this one. What is it? It's, I don't know. They sold it to me. The guy, the guy in the suit sold it to me. He's a filthy fan. It's called Boys the Sambles. You spray it, you smell it for three seconds, and then the Critical takes it. I haven't seen Critical in, 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 in a minute. You paid 100. You didn't pay 100. 150 pounds for that. I was, yeah. I was there. You paid 1 pound. Judy was there with me. Judy was there, yeah. That smells like. Um, um, after shaving bump spray. Oh, this is a bad smell. Yeah, it's terrible. No disrespect. That's I terrible. This, I bought this for my hair. Oh, this is a bad. Sm- this is a bad smell, specs, man. Yeah, you you got talked into buying that because this is nothing like Dior Sauvage either, by the way. Jesus is Lord. Jordy, you see, this is this is why Jordy is a. <laughs> I was, yeah, but I went to go <laughs> free faced tomato ketchup sauce. <laughs> Jordy, what do you think of this? Oh, specs, this is you. <laughs> The girls are gonna be around you doing hurdles. Hurdles. Ah, well now, now, T, let me throw this one to you then. You've been at the counter with specs. Yes. How annoying is it? If someone doesn't <laughs> tell him to buy, he will keep doing rondos. I, I got tired of the rondos. Take your time, man, at a till or counter. Take your time. Make sure you make the right decision. You're spending money. But you will go. Uh, Jordy, you sure? So long that if someone doesn't say do it, you'll go. Nah, 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 nah. And then you've wasted half an hour. You know why you're five face <laughs> <laughs> barbecue sauce? Like eight litre bottle as well. Because when we was in Barcelona and you forced me to buy that hat, you came straight to the show and tarnished that hat. I did not force you to buy that hat. <laughs> but I was very bored of you looking at everything. <laughs> yeah, man, buy that. <laughs> but go on. <laughs> every, every time you said, what do you think? What did I say? <laughs> <laughs> what what make it, a decision what did it say on it i forget now tiger tiger oh tiger tiger but I, mean, I never saw that i said every time you said what do you think of the hat i said it says tiger tiger it's the grin every time it's your grin that's all i said it's your grin <laughs> oh. he gives me this razor among grin like go on no do it. lewis and ash talked you into buying that hat but you were buying that hat how anyway. are they by the way uh yeah they're, they're, no, they're doing well yeah yeah can't um, just fly, fly. Go, can't go holiday with someone and then just and never speak to them. We, 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 need, like, we need to talk Ash into coming on this show, actually. And Elka? Cause he, nah, not even. Uh, oh, Blanca. 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 He gets into some ridiculous stuff that would be great for this show. Let's get him on, man. Hinge, let's get hinge him on. dates. Oh, man, yeah, let's get him on. I, we mm. need that. Because obviously these rappers don't want to come out. I don't think they want to come on, you know. Jordy, you, you've had a great year. <laughs> <laughs> had a great show. What Why date? would you leave that show and decide, God, come, I need to speak to you for a second. What was the date of the show? The date of the show was 26th of October. Okay. So I didn't go. I thought I was, I nearly went, but obviously my daughter was born like two weeks before that. Yeah. And Geordie, I heard Geordie stressing about the guest list on the, the day before. And I thought, let me just, let me just not be a... I, no, I did the same. Cause Dazza bought a ticket, but Dazza bought two tickets. Right. And it's meant, usually meant to be for me and him, but he decided. He wanted to bring a mommy, mm-hmm. which was actually my mommy. Oh. Yeah. And then <laughs> so at, he, the sh- at the show. So, but she didn't turn up. <laughs> 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 T, I'm talking like 2010. This mommy was, you know, I had a, a leg lock. <laughs> and all of a sudden, Daz wants to wrestle her. Daz, what are you doing? What do you mean? My pollution's on her. <laughs> She's Sean Stasiak. I know. So leg Daz is lock. just doing second hands, man. I don't know what he's doing, but... um. He tried to take, he's like, specs, you can't get in. And I didn't want to stress Jordy out as well. I called Jordy, just, Jordy said, well, just come early, but I thought, well, I was somewhere. I, I was know, somewhere. I don't know where you was. He told me you was about, and you was going to pull up, and you don't care what you do, you're, get, you're getting in. But yeah, I knew so I was getting I just, in. I just left you to your own devices, man. But yeah, last minute, Daz was like, no, I got your ticket. 
so yeah, we just when we got there, our names was you put our names down, so I don't know what you were doing. But you'd you'd sold out within twenty four hours of this show being announced. Great show, man. Yeah, but people think I sold out way later. So you know what happens? They ask at the ninetieth minute. Mm. I know it was a headache, man. But it's a great show. From everything I've heard, everything I've seen. It was a good show. Um man. But you know what happened, boys? Before my show, my leg was hurting a bit. Yeah. My ankle, my left ankle. Yeah, but okay, but, but you all right, but yeah, why? I thought maybe I rolled it or something in the gym. I don't know. Like, why is this hurting? But I thought, you know what? Ignore it. Whatever. Crack on. Ignore it. Yeah. Ignore it. Do my show. It's hurting a bit, but whatever. Ignore it. Crack on. I'm performing. Mosh pit. I was with you. I, yeah, I was with you then. <laughs> I get, he, he was shouting at me in the, in the mosh pit. You dickhead. <laughs> <laughs> what song was it? Crinkum. Okay, yeah. So now I'm in a cab home. That's that flow, by the way, on that has been taken yeah, by a lot great. of rappers. It, I'm in the cab. I'm in the cab home now, and my leg. The adrenaline is wearing off. My leg's shouting at me now. I get out the cab to walk home. I'm limping. So I said, you know what? I just take the weekend off, man. I've had a good show. I've had a good year. I take the weekend off. But the weekend, my legs get on worse. I love the idea. The weekend off. What, what were you gonna do that weekend? Oh, well, I was gonna. I was gonna do a um, victory lap. <laughs> okay, yeah, a million yeah, percent. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But um, you was on great as well. Yes, I told you. You couldn't get out of bed. I was updating you, like, actually, yeah. Yeah, I remember. I was like, boys, it's worse. He boys, said it's worse. He said I'm on black. <laughs> <laughs> so now, my, my consortium, the team behind me, my mum, my sisters, they're saying, it's time for you to go A&E. Brother, allow it. When's the last time you went A&E? What? Your mum said A&E? Africans don't talk about A&E usually. They talk about pastors. You know what? You you've got up, you, your parents updated. You know they they really. I've, I've noticed Jordy's got a family that are like connected to the British. Um, what's the word? British establishment. Because my ones, they're still one hand in Africa, one hand in Britain. One day I'm gonna tell you a lot about my dad because he's on a thing. You know. Oh wow. Yeah. We can't. I don't think we can even say those is two it? words together without YouTube. Okay. Well, like, okay. Is it? Oh, that that keeper. That well, let's, keeper. Let's, let's let's bleep it then. Yeah. yeah that but he's on that goalkeeper. He's yeah. on a that man thing. But um, I said, no, I'm not going to um, a &E. But you know, you you tend to lose to a bunch of women. Went to a &E. They said six hour wait. I went home. But when I went home, this is all happening in one day. When I went home, I got a fever. I was Harlem shaking in the bed. So I went back to a &E. So that, So there's a, theory, <laughs> there's a theory. If something's wrong in your body, it causes fever and colds and all that kind of stuff, right? Well, no. Well, the problem with his body was the thing that the same the same thing was causing both issues. No, no, no. If you catch a cold, it means something's gone wrong in somewhere in your body. That's that's well, actually kind, a kind of, but no, but no, <laughs> but no. <laughs> what no. are you talking about? I'm, I'm telling you. <laughs> if I'm you catch a cold, it's because your white blood cells couldn't attack the germ again, fast enough. You're not. You're you're only based. That's media. That's <laughs> that's, that's media, media behavior. There's also conspiracy theories that go and dig deeper. So if you've got uh, if you've got a cold, you've actually got a broken leg. Yeah, there's something's wrong somewhere. Yeah. So my first any &E was North Mid. Nail. That's why I went home. North Middlesex. Yeah. yeah. I got the shivers. I went to a new a and &E, Whittington. I'm sitting there for six. These are bad hospitals, by the way. Yeah. These are very bad hospitals. No, Islington. Oh, okay. I should have gone um, the one in Houston. But anyway, whatever. No carpet, you know, just hard floors. <laughs> oh my God. If I tell you about the goblins, I yeah, saw an a &E. There we go. But never mind. Yeah. I'm sitting there for six <laughs> hours. a and &E's not an easy place to be in, oh. a, in a capital city. I'll be you right. know what they say about hospitals, isn't it? Uh, we'll, we'll talk about it after. So then, so six hours later, they call me in. Actually, you know what? I told you, I'll tell you what happened. I walked into the A&E, 10 minutes. Judy, what? I was bowling. That yeah. feeling is class. Yeah. I yeah. was that But they're only, they're only putting you in another waiting room though. So now, oh. I'm sitting the with, with the woman. Tell me what's wrong. I told her what's wrong. Took my blood. Ah, okay, go back and sit Hold there. Hold on, how do they take your blood? Me? Nah, man. Ah, cool. How would you have your blood taken? <laughs> how you, what? How are they going to take your blood? When, I remember when I was about 13 years old. Punch in the nose. Little finger. Prickle. <laughs> Prickle. <laughs> I remember that like it was yesterday. Nah. Arm out. Yeah, elastic band. They need a lot of blood. There it is. <laughs> <laughs> oh my virus. God. My what? doctor couldn't find my vein. That's what I'm saying. Sometimes they put the needle in and take it out. Think, okay. Said, what? what? Nah, man, nah. Anyway, I walked into the A&E. Tell me it's like, Jordy, I'm bowling. I'm looking at them like, ha ha. Took my blood. They said, "Yeah, go back and sit down. It'll be six hour wait." I said, "What? What? Yeah, rat with me." So now I'm sitting there six hours. Six hours later, I get seen to. What do you do for six, six hours? Six hours. Yes, yeah, sir. You waited. I had to. I thought you left. You, you had to wait again. Yeah. If I didn't wait, I would have been brown bread. 
So for six hours, Wait, let's get there. <laughs> for six hours, I'm texting you lot. We're just chatting about um, Psycho Sid and Royal Rumble. No, no, no. Six hours. You're in Archway. Six hours means go home, come back. Yeah, but it, you could be any time. No, yeah, it could hours. be anything. You think if I, if they told me it's exactly six hours, I'm getting, I'm kicking on. Mm. That's cool. That's not hospital. <laughs> but now nah, they finally see me. They look at my ankle. They say, "Rah, it's not normal." Next thing I know, yeah, I'm a, I'm on a bed. Head back, I'm, I'm looking away, and there's a uh, there's a needle in my ankle. What? Yeah. What? Ankle high, yeah. head back. Oh, wait, hold on, hold on. So you can't see what they're doing? No. But I don't want to. I don't want to. Yeah, you don't want to see it. I yeah. don't want to see it. Excuse me? I Are don't you on your belly? But there's a needle on my no. ankle, yeah? No, I'm on my back. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to know. <laughs> I know what you're up to. <laughs> I know what you're up to. Because they need an armrest. <laughs> 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 Jordy, <laughs> Jordy, <laughs> your back door got pushed up a bit. You know it already. You're in denial. <laughs> You're in denial, mate. Well, shut up, man. Let me tell my story. <laughs> That's dumb. Oh. Anyway, I got I got my eyes closed, but there's a needle in my ankle. I open my eyes. The ne- the the needle's yellow. I said, I said what? Is that going in my ankle or coming out of my ankle, brother? Pass. Oh God. It's coming out. So hold on, hold on. So your blood has changed colour here. Uh, yeah, let's say let's say that. Well no, it's pass. <laughs> pass is um is the germs and bacteria around an infection that So he said if it gets too bad it will So pull. so he so you you could have basically lost a leg amputation, right? I could have filled my toes. So yeah, he 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 could have lost a leg, yeah. <laughs> I'm telling you, no, if I lost the leg, you lot would never see me again. That's, I mean, it's great content. Yeah. I'm, I would not do content again. I don't even need my leg for this, but I wouldn't be here. You just have to throw every right trainer away. <laughs> 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 I'm not paying full price for trainers either. Of course not. That's ridiculous. You need a box. <laughs> Half a box. <laughs> you don't even need them. <laughs> <laughs> Crazy. So now he takes out the syringe. He's looking at me. He said, "Yeah, you're gonna have to stay, mate. This ain't right." Next thing I know, <laughs> the syringe. What? Like he's looking at a, a full yellow Brother. tube of. Okay. He said, "Yeah, this ain't right. You need surgery tomorrow. I got um a, a septic arthritis, which is horrible." And I stayed there for a week. I saw a. You know, I had to wear the, the gown where you, the, you show your bum. Yeah, but. <laughs> <laughs> you got, your mum's on show. Jody got molested. <laughs> your mum's on show, innit? No, it's got a flap. Well, what I did is I tied it. I tied it but so my mum's not we, showing. <laughs> <laughs> I tied it so my mum's not showing. But she said, no, you need to untie it. I said, why? Can I ask a question? Because obviously, T, I know you've got some doctors and nurses in your family. Yeah, I don't. Why does your bum have to be open? when all these things are going on? It's a great question. I'm guessing, okay, I, yeah. here's why. Because some people don't have the mobility while they're in hospital to be able to get around and pull up and whatever. So I guess it's easier to use the toilet. I saw I saw a lot of white bumps. Cause you know, you know these are, these, these are scenes in porn right now. Really? Yeah. What? What? Brother, if you type in ER scene. It didn't feel sexy when I was in there. Bro, the mummy comes in talking to the patient, she turns around, doggy star. <laughs> <laughs> and the thing is, it's a big trick because the front of the clip, I can see like the bottom of her jeans. But you know people like to rip jeans and have a style. Her one, the back, <laughs> I think, so open. <laughs> so Jordy, <laughs> I've got a question to ask. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> Was there any, you know, sort of? Oh, shut up! All right, cool. No comment. No comment. Yeah. Yeah. No comment. <laughs> <laughs> so, just to give you an update on septic arthritis, you can get septic arthritis if germs get into a joint. Mm-hmm. Right. This can happen if you have an injury or accident to a joint. Mm-hmm. This can happen if germs from somewhere else in the body spread into the blood and then into a joint. And it can happen as a complication of a joint surgery. So it's, it's like it can happen in so many different ways. Is this the first time you've had this? Ever. Remember what I was telling you, look, boys, I think I've got a gout. Yeah. So let me ask you, what's caused this? Because I'm worried that this might happen to me. I don't know, but I'm good now. 
Apparently. No, but they should tell you this is the cause of this stuff. Yeah, but they don't know my life. They're not with me. Well, we, we think we've nailed it down, though, don't we? Your yeah. doctors gave you some... I'm back. I'm back, man. So how many people come to see you in the hospital, Jordy? Uh, <laughs> 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 is this the bar? How many people came to see you? You know what? If I'm honest, though, I was on some don't, don't you dare come see me. Are you, did you try? You're not allowed to come oh, yeah, see me and, and my, my bum's out, man. I'll be honest, because, I'm spe- because we were speaking to him every day, yeah, he feels my like assumption day. was, yeah. today's the day he comes home. Today's the day he comes home. Today's the day he comes home. Do you remember like, I was supposed to go, I was supposed to come no rules. I went back to hospital. Yeah. That's what we made a sub, innit? Yeah. That's yeah. all. Because the thing is, you know what's mad? We're, we're, we're actually not talking to the group. Obviously, Tigo's a professional. He knows all this stuff. <laughs> you, 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 <laughs> you're using all big words. I'm just like, my days, what's going on with Jordy? Like, I don't know. I don't know what's going on. But if I can hear your voice or the voice note, I know you're cool. Don't know. There was like day four in the hospital. I'm sleeping there. They had me in a room. I thought, that's class. I'm in the, I'm in the Ritz. All right, let's discuss this. Let's discuss this. But after the surgery, I did not room. I did curtains. Yeah, the curtains. Curtains. Yeah. So you a, got TV? I had an iPad. I had my iPad. Yeah, you got that TV though, but you don't want to use it. Yeah, I'm not using it. Okay, rubbish. so you got your curtains. So you've got your own little, that's your own little room. But you can, you can still hear snoring, right? See, on this side, there's a man with, I think he had some sort of gastric problem. He kept burping. No, okay. I want to move. I want to move cells here. Bro, I was annoyed. <laughs> he kept Gee, come on. Was there people farting as well? Nah, oh, the, lady, the lady on my right now, she was cool until one morning, I smelled doo-doo, innit? And I just heard, heard it. If you could just roll over. They're helping her shit. And where's, where do you eat your food? <laughs> no, 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 I'm, I'm, <laughs> did you eat hospital food? No, nah, no way. Oh, okay. okay, what about people that, you know, in hospital, they can leave their little curtain place and walk around the hospital. Yeah, that, like be- that, that became me. Yeah, but he had no foot. Oh yeah, you got you got a foot injury. Yeah, that became me though. There's a the minute I could like hop, I hopped. I was out. Miss, I need air. I need air. I'm okay, going. What up. about what the crutch? No, oh wheelchair. wheelchair. You know I wouldn't let my I wouldn't let myself sit in that. Wheelchairs are class. I yeah, they seem class. I wouldn't I let myself. Some people zet. Some people got like yeah, you know, yeah tech yeah, yeah. Bubba. Like turbo and all that. I wouldn't let my. The problem is now with the, with my crutches. I've noticed everyone has a crutch. You know how like one day you'll buy a Fiat Punto and suddenly there's bare Fiat Puntos on the road. That's my, that's my problem. There was a crutch in my dad's house, by the way. I forgot to mention. <laughs> Why are you laughing? Because I was going to use it for, for the Halloween, one of the Halloween parties. <laughs> <laughs> you were going to be your dad. <laughs> 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 I was going to have that tongue out, boy. <laughs> my, my, where's your tongue out? <laughs> Don't be rude. So when, so um, when you're hopping about the hospital, uh, is anyone like, hey, that's Geordie, isn't it? Hopping about the hospital. <laughs> the main doctor's telling me, what do you do? I'm keeping it brief. Media. Watch his assistant. Yeah, filthy. Come on. <laughs> Brother, I want to discharge myself <laughs> right there. So this, so someone in the crowd has actually seen yeah. your back door. <laughs> yeah. yeah. More than one. More than one, 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 yeah. My back, my back door, yeah. So how did you go to the toilet in that? What? Same. Yeah, no, yeah, crutch. Just crutch it to the toilet. So. Toilet so low. You got, fault, you got a few false dawns. Doctors coming in telling you, Jordy, we're ready to send you home. Yeah, that kept happening. Like serious, serious doctors. Then. An Asian boy came into my my pulled the curtains. Good the Asians, man. They're doing what? It's been, Asians have a great week, by the way. But that's what I thought. I thought this. Selling nudes. I yeah, thought, ah, cool. Food, yeah. I thought this Asian boy must be like he must be the final boss. That's how he walked in. So he goes to me, uh, Jordi McKayza, right? Yeah. I'm a med student. I just want to ask you questions. I bugged out. What? He's med what? student? Get the fuck out of here, man. <laughs> that's so rude, work experience. Oh my T, I God. had en- I had enough. So Jordi, was you? There, there was a film I watched. Yeah, this is one of my best films ever. But I don't know what it's called. Felix will help me here anyway. Where someone goes into the hospital, but secretly the doctors take you to the bottom, take you downstairs, take bits of organs and your legs and your nails and all that kind of stuff. But it was their secret. You remember that film? Awake. Yes. Okay. Let's Great just, film. Let's just look at Awake. Do you know what I did think though? There was a point where they they gave me like a oh Jessica Alba. What's the thing that puts you course, completely out? Terence Howard. Terence Howard's in Awake. Um, I watched Awake. Uh, anesthetic. How many stars um, that film got? Should be seven. On IMDb, it's rated at 6.5. Jordi, is your leg yours? Have you checked? Oh, it's, it's, it feels like mine. T- 
toes, everything's yours, yeah? Yeah. How, how are you feeling now? I'm weak as hell, you know? Really? I'm tired. Like, I feel like Mark's right now. Have you kicked the infection? Yeah, it's gone. Like, and there's no cold or flu-y kind of... T, what would, what would happen if, like, you know what I mean? You know, because he knocked on God's door, God didn't answer, but God says, you know, oh, who's this? Who's this? Opens it and lets him in. And oh that's gone. If what I'm... are we doing? Are we, like, honestly, what are we doing? Like, I wanna, I wanna, I know we shouldn't talk about this, but I wanna, what are we doing? <laughs> if someone Wait, got should, filthy, it's the stairs. Should we play this out? This, what yeah, we do? It's different people will have different. Should we um, play this out? I done my show and I went. I, I think, think that's so gangster. I, it's not. Oh, because that, because <laughs> you should have done a bigger show. Um, <laughs> Geordie, if it happens to Geordie, we have to honor the man that we know. Oh no. If it happens to Lippy, we have to honor the man that we know. Lippy wants, I manned him, let's talk about Lippy and everything he done, how sick he was there. You gotta talk about it. That's what Lippy wants. Geordie wants everyone to bust jokes. How is he, how did he hit the stairs? But would you be able to do that? I think, I think it would be difficult, but I think so, yeah. You have to, you have to. I've made jokes, <laughs> yeah. I've made jokes close to death. I'm, I'm a lot better at it these days. I think, I always say, being around you has helped me to find humor in Jordi, that. I think if you went, I think my, my content would be, would be about you for a year. I would destroy, like, for, I would destroy you. I told you, I've done a joke to my mum about going. Is it? Yeah, yeah. but she's, she's British, man. You, you don't do that, man. Do you know what she done to me? I swear down. I told my mum, look, no one, no one, don't, like, don't tell no one I'm in here. I'm in here. Because if you tell anyone I'm in here, Africans, it's a rave in this hospital now. So I didn't, no, she didn't, yeah. But there was a point where she, she walked out my room and came back in and the phone's on loudspeaker. And then uh, my mum goes, um, just five minutes, yeah? I said, five minutes for what? Pastor, we're ready. Mm, okay. Father God, he just goes. I said, what the hell is this, man? <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> oh my God. Have you, thank, have you thanked him? I mean, yeah, I guess he, yeah, I, mean, I guess he busted. Yeah, they yeah. need to go. Who? Rikishi, that, these lot need to go. Rikishi needs to go? No, the guys that oh, the uh, hang around the Africans. You know what the yeah. thing is? Same, I can do this and that. I just, I could tell like he had his feet up, he's playing FM as well, and he's just, just freestyling. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> what, <laughs> mom. I told you don't tell no one. Yeah, but he's a pastor. We tell him everything. So he just knows everything. But the thing is as well, if you, if you tell the pastor, you say, look, I need I need a prayer. He'll say, look, I'll give you, what, what do you need? You need a three minute? Do you need an eight minute? Do you need a 19 minute? I got a different, different tiers to this thing. So if you just gone with a three minute, then you're, you're all right. Oh, she didn't go with a three minute. If she had it well way, he would have come with the oil. Yeah. If you, if you go back and the doctor says you've got 16 weeks to live, Mm. You make sure you do a live show from your bed and we come and watch. That's never been done before. I think I'm the first person to ever perform with septic arthritis though. I doubt it. <laughs> What's it called? Septic arthritis. Septic arthritis. But you could have lost your foot. I could have lost my foot. But the, the wrestler, Texas Tornado, aka Kerry Von Eric, he lost his foot, but he had a wooden foot and he used to still wrestle. Mm -mm. So you could still rap mm -mm. with a wooden foot. I, pro I refused. I would love if you had a wooden foot, honestly. That would be... Cause you you only see that in in like in, in um films that have got like ship you know Caribbean and pirate whatever it's called pirates of the Caribbean yeah 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 you always yeah. see it with ships yeah. you like, I've never seen one a road about, in Shoreditch yeah. if I lose anything I'm done I remember my train my old coach yeah had uh these two fingers missing and I didn't know till I shook his hand and I was mad because I touched it Jordy did you did you did I what cry. Mm. You know, if I was next to you, side by side, what would what would you be hearing? Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> no, Jordy, I'm being dead serious. I will, I will have a go. I couldn't though. This guy was burping and this lady was um, shitting every now and then. And every like four hours they'll come and do my cannula. Yeah, but then you would you would know Can what time what's, they're coming. Wait, what's a cannula? They put a tube in your hand so the IV goes straight into your blood. Oh, okay. In four hours? Uh, or was it antibiotics? Straight antibiotics. Yeah. Dylan, he said every four hours. So you told me in 10 minutes, you could just have a quick go. <laughs> like you ain't got a bus. <laughs> no, but you never know. Uh, do you know what? My only pro my problem was there's, there was like a, opposite me was a patient that was like nocturnal. In the, in the day, she's out. But in the night, oh, doctor, mm. please. See, that's, that's why I said to you, they're, they're, they're not real. Every hospital has someone at night revving. 
<laughs> That's an actor. The mosh pit, because I put that on Twitter. Mm. People were shocked when right. they saw your mosh pit, yeah. Yeah, but that's because you edited it. No. <laughs> <laughs> you, you didn't show them the truth. We were in Barcelona. Oh, wow. Yeah, it's Don't there. Don't do that. It's there. Is it there? Don't yeah. do that. It's actually getting a bit higher. It is, it is. is it? Let me it's ask creeping. Is it there? Definitely. It's creeping. Mummy's in clock, though, because they're, they're all petite. You're petite. Yeah, that's not that petite movie. <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. Thumbnail. No, no, no. There's too many people going to watch this for but that. Do you know what? I, this mosh pit is a small mosh pit. You know what? Do you know what the karma is for? It's for making jokes about Gareth Bell. I've never made jokes about Gareth Bell. But do you know what? I don't, I don't mind. Get, I, I want the Zidane right now. I want it. Yeah, but Zidane, like, you can't have a great hairline in that. Zidane, at least his that's hairline. That's the problem. Was yeah, you're right. I, I, need, I need to lose the hairline, innit? <laughs> you have to. To be fair, though, I remember... And this is obviously we just had Darren Bent on Filthy last week. Yeah, he's got a patch in it. Darren Bent had a yeah, patch when yeah, he played, but yeah. it was not evident. Yeah, uh, when he was here, Darren Bent went Turkey. Sorry, man. That I, I, I said, why did I buy sweets? What's going on? Oh, you got the peach I ones. I got the peach ones. Yeah, do you want one? You know, people have called me since the last no rules, isn't it? You can just throw me one. Why? Oh yeah. Yeah, because no. the way you lot told it. Oh, but you nearly hit the stairs. I was knocking on Heaven's door. What? I was actually. I, was. I think we're all going to knock on heaven's door one day. Well, yeah. No, no. <laughs> knock. Not let. Wait, so remember, God lets you in usually. So my dad, God let him in. No maybe, idea. I don't know. No maybe, idea. but yeah. Maybe. I was thinking that the other day, my, a friend of mine, um, the other day woke up and couldn't, like he felt like numbness in all his limbs. Look at that. And he had to go to hospital. What are you not eating, by the way? Look at that. I'm not. Are you, I'm do, you still, do you still eat chicken and meat? No, I never had it. But this is what I mean. I told you a lot about my dad. He said, this. Do you know what he did? He drove me home after the discharge. Will he come, yeah? in? Will he come in? Who, my dad? Yeah. No, he doesn't believe He doesn't believe in oh. internet analysis Facebook. Yeah, but this, he doesn't have to be <laughs> well, in the no, internet. No, Steve, yeah. cool. We'll, we'll put Facebook stickers on the table. <laughs> yeah, exactly, yeah. <laughs> no, honestly, that, he was, he's sold. But my dad, yeah, he's driving me home. It's a quiet ride. He goes, I bet when you get home, you're gonna go back to eating takeaways, isn't it? Yeah. He's one of them, man. You have to think about your diet. Look at me. Seven years, all fish. How's he doing physically? He's lying, man. My sister's told me the truth, man. He <laughs> he's been sneaking meat. <laughs> he's lying, bro. But I just let him land. I just let him land. I, I, honestly, I feel a difference not eating chicken and meat. Oh, shut up. But Are you, you telling haven't not eaten Yeah, exactly. What's he talking about? Once a week? It's a difference. Ah, so what did you have in money? Oh yeah, of course. Back to the key. You have to. You have to because I you know what I mean? I have no choice. I'm inside a stadium and tea come on. You know, I'm not, I can't find a smoothie. <laughs> <at Old Trafford. laughs> I looked and looked. You've got all these flipping tills, all these drinks, all these no one there's nothing healthy in the football stadium. That's what Ronaldo said though about Old Trafford. That's a good point though, because you know what I was I was in America they take the food in stadiums very seriously. I went to Yankee Stadium and I was like, let's go see what they got. And they got some mad obviously I don't eat chicken, but they got some mad thing chicken tenders and all this stuff that's like award winning stuff. Because I don't eat that stuff a lot, like, because it's America, I'm guessing that everything's fried together. So I'm not I'm not eating anything yeah, from facts, there. Facts. I did think what what is actually like popcorns as close to healthy as you can get? I think in a football in a what sports is, what stadium. What is popcorn, by the way? What is it made out of? Corn <laughs> that's popped. <laughs> you sure? Yeah. You know I don't eat. Uh, I don't like popcorn in it. That's fine. I don't. Yeah, that's I hear teeth it. Can't no, take but popcorn. I feel like I hear it. I feel like when I bite popcorn, I feel like I'm biting like a beetle or a bee. Well, do you know what I mean? It's because it's got the shell yeah, of corn on it. Yeah. So for me, I feel like my theory again. I think popcorn are insects. But they're not. Okay, you're you're popcorn. Right. Are <laughs> you're laughing now, it? But the truth will come out in two years. <laughs> People, check out Hassan Kabul. You know the thing about, about, about specs? Sometimes this stuff, this stuff lands. <laughs> <laughs> I know, I know. Out of nowhere, there would be a story saying like, oh, 60% of popcorn is officially be Beatles. Oh. Like, Damn it. Boys, does anyone want any rap snacks? Yeah, let's give it a go, man. Because um, Jordy just discovered that Lil Boosie's a really good rapper the other day. I love him, is man. Is he good? No, oh, I love Lil him. Lil Boosie's so good. Is he good? Because I only listened to his Back interviews. in the day, Lil Boosie used to be cold nah, before Boosie. he went jail. 
Boosie's sick, man. I think he's got some fangs. Why do you love him? Why does no one love him? This is Louisiana Heat. Why do people love him? Yeah, like, I, I, I see people, I see him at, I put a video on. He's like the first one from his town. Man. And yeah, like his town, everyone was, had a high top. Like, yeah, like like the Boosie first... Fade was massive. He's like the first one from his he's town. He's like his own fade. Boosie Fade, that's called the Boosie Fade. That's class. You look, I, I think it's weird because people really only know him from saying crazy stuff on Vlad TV. Mm. I can't do it. Why? Boosie stinks, man. Let me see. Louisiana Heat, nah, man. I'm not eating Boosie. He said Boosie stinks. Mm. That's very salt. Very salty. I can't do it. Who sent me these, JDK? Yeah, it's at home. He didn't even tell me who sent them, he just sent them. Just some wrap snacks. They made little baby cheddar cheese and sour cream. See, this is what I mean. Hey. I, I would take offense to... Like, no, no. What? Are you crazy? Oh, you like them? I hate these people. <laughs> <laughs> I hate that's, them that's people. Up. That's, that's up. up. Yeah. Wait, these are, oh my God. <laughs> That's so sorry. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Specs, are you a fan of Moneybag Yo? You like Moneybag Yo? Is it, that, um, it is you. Who remembers um, Son in Law? No, that's NBA Youngboy. Oh, I don't, I don't know this guy. Moneybag Yo's from Memphis. Moneybag Yo's great. He's got dill pickle jalapeno, and these are potato chips. They're not ridged. Jordy, this whole refusing to taste these things, is this because of your dad? Yeah, honestly, because he might be watching. Because um, I told them I'm going back to work this week. So they're all monitoring me. Oh, wow. What the hell is that? I don't think someone's there. No, no, isn't it? No. Can Wait. I just say, um, Young Spray wouldn't agree with this. No. <laughs> what the hell is this? Taste that. He's not going to move on from his little... No. <laughs> from his little... <laughs> <boosie. Louisiana. laughs> yeah. From his little boozy Chris. Come on, little boozy, boozy fade now. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta get one. The the the, the mosh pit. Boozy, what are, oh my what god! Are You've tried everything what? but a high top. You've done every trim but a high top. I've had a high top. No, you haven't, man. Mm -hmm. Alright, send a pic. I've not seen a high top. Do you think you can do a high top in 2024? No. No way. Why? What's, what's going on? <laughs> people are listening are to you. Are you pointing and are you rolling dice? What? You, ca you can't do a high top because you shoulder shake. Of course. <laughs> the little bit of shoulder shake. How? Huh? All right, Specs, you're now going to try the dill pickle jalapeno Hold on. by Money Bag Yo. The taste on this one is so strong, I don't even know if it's going to cancel this one, you know? <laughs> <laughs> Who's the best rapper here? Um, it's Boosie, Money Bag Yo, Baby, and Monster P. Best right now? I would go money bag yo, but ba little baby's probably better. But Boosie's the all time better. This is the worst package I've ever had in my life. The worst one? What's his name? Money bag yo. Money bag yo. Money bag no. <laughs> <laughs> don't ever do this again. You're gonna let Dylan have a try. Oh, sorry, Dylan, man. No, well, you don't like money bag yo. All right, cool. Finish. No, Finish is fasting. Now we got Master P. Master P, uh, make him say uh, and he's got Barbie Quinn with my honey. Barbecuing with my honey. It's, it's like it's a barbecue. Yeah, it's, it's definitely barbecue. <laughs> um, Master B's gone, though. No. What? What? No. Master B. He's Master here. He's been here. Yeah. He had Why? beef with his son the other day. Yeah. And this is this is a regular crisp as well. Barbecuing with my honey. It's, you gotta try this one, Jordy. What a flipping hell, no, but I'll try one. Master P's a legend. An LT, man. Yeah. JTK, JTK, you killing me, man. I don't know about that one. My mouth's burning, Bob. <laughs> from, from the Louisiana Is it burning? No, but you ate like half a pack. No, it's because you're a bowl cut, that's why. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Alright, cool. Oh! Mm -hmm. Yeah, sorry. Sweet, though. Why that one's nice? I know this. This is, um... Smoky bacon. Mm -mm. Not smoky bacon. Mm, that's barbecue. You're going to say it's prawn cocktail. Yeah, c you know tomato ketchup crisps? Mm, yeah, okay. Oh, what's the short? What's the sauce? Mm -hmm. Well, that's yours actually. That tastes like barbecue Pringles. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Mm. By the way, very good. Did you know people up north, yeah? Which is Manchester, right? Yeah. <laughs> they eat walk uh, uh, watsis and hula hoops together, and what they do, they squeeze the what's it into the hula hoop. Did you know that? They, as in the whole of Manchester, people up north. Because I've never heard this. I, I found it yesterday when I was in Manchester. 
and this is little babies cheddar cheese and sour cream that doesn't feel like they've no. put much thought into that it's not that's not that's not happening no. cheddar cheese <laughs> and s- sour cream nah Americans take um, these serious though crisps they don't even call it what do they call it chips they're very I don't know how they've made these really sweet but they are Specs you'll like these you know so I'll just say yeah when you're hungry and you eat crisps, it's the best thing ever. Better than food, right? Mm. Better than food. Yeah. When you're hungry and eat, it's, it's cool. When you're hungry and eat crisps, oh, it's a boner. No, it's, that's when crisps, are, when crisps are at their best. Just stemming. All right, all right, man. <laughs> we we try them. <laughs> My <laughs> uncle used to own a pub down the world, yeah, back in the day. What? Yeah. A black uncle? Yeah. I forget his name now. I forget his name. Your black uncle owned a pub? Yeah. Black people don't own pubs. Oh. I'm gonna call my aunt and ask do you mean, her. Do you mean? But oh. we don't talk. <laughs> oh yeah. You know what? I'm gonna ask her, man. Ah uh, yeah, do do it. Break the ice. Remember, me and my auntie don't talk, yeah. But I'm asking this question. I'm locking her off. I'm locking her off. We're still not talking, but I need to talk now. <laughs> then we go back to no talking. Is that okay? <laughs> <laughs> oh, I would love if she lets you ring out. We haven't spoke since. <laughs> since don't you don't have to finish that sentence. Yeah, what, what, what was the um, what was the name of um, the the uncle that had um, the pub in um, Dawson? Um, Nigerian. Long, long time ago. Hello. Yeah, hello. Yeah, the Cameroonian man. It's called Tandy. Tandy, Uncle Tandy. We're not talking. <laughs> <laughs> We're not talking. <laughs> you try to call back. You're gonna to speak to my assistant. <laughs> the voice <mode. laughs> Uncle Tandy. Uncle Tandy. Boys. So what? He's on your Nigerian side. Uncle Tandy. So all your Nigerian size un- thirteen though. So all your own uncle. Shut up. I swear down. His loafers always like. If you're talking to him, you gotta be across the road. Because <laughs> his loafers. You you think it's a car? No, <laughs> his loafers like you, bruv, Go give him a hug. You got to step. You got to walk on his loafers <laughs> <laughs> to give him a hug. Uncle Tandy, I hope he's still with us. Uncle Tandy, if you're not with us, man, man, you are a great uncle for me. But basically, he had a black uncle with a pub. Yeah, he used to have a pub in Dawson. So back in the day, you know, in the nineties, you know. Nah, man, it's a bar, man. It's a. It was a pub. We used to after church. We used to go to his pub after. Yeah, but I used to always be hungry. Always yeah. crisps. McCoy salt and vinegar. That's a pub. After when you're starving, that's a pub crisp. You don't need to eat anything after that. When you're a kid, get salt and vinegar McCoy's or chili McCoy's, which were the better ones back in the day, and uh, a Pepsi. And a Pepsi. Oh man, Uncle Tandy, man, I'm gonna find him. Do you reckon he's got another pub? A one hundred percent. Yeah. can buy books in there. <laughs> I, I don't care what anyone tells me. The pub's up there. I've got books. I'll tell you that now. When's the last, time, performing when's the last well. time you went in the pub? What's the last time I went in the pub? Oh, well, uh, when I met um, Love Jane Brendan the other day. So I went, uh, oh, yeah, 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 we was in the pub. They would Pubs be. are class now, though. I can't lie to you, they're class. Well, in the areas you're talking about, yeah. Class, yeah, we was in Belsize Park, amazing. Oh, wow. Yeah, carpet. That's, not, that's, that's not even a pub. Fancy carpet. pubs are class. They've got like menus and that. Gastro yeah. pub, yeah. Tea? Wait, no, it was two Sundays ago, I had a roast in a, um, a pub in Ballum. Vegetarian roast? Very classy. Yeah, pubs are class. Yeah. What's on your roast? I mean, which, it's everything that you would eat, except I had the, um, like a mushroom thing. Is there gravy? Yeah, but it's like most, m- most of the gravy in like restaurants and that ain't necessarily meat. Fuck it now, man. Just wanna say, I think there was a game on, or something, something was on. Pub wasn't busy, but one or two fans, there's one guy sitting by himself. I think it was West Ham playing Europe or something. <laughs> yeah. Everybody looks at him. And he's just watching the football. Yeah. <laughs> Why do they do that to you? You're by yourself. You know your boys. You just shout hammers. Yeah. <laughs> but pub means something else to different people. Like pub is like church, oh man. Oh my god. When was the last time you went to a pub, by the way? Oh man, I ain't seen my white boys in time because they do um 
they do coke and, <gasps> they, and they tell me they love me a hundred times. I'm I saw a puff for sale. You saw a puff for sale? No, I am. Should we buy it? So hold on. Near where you are? Yeah. Amazing. It's not far from me. What are you telling me like I'm not going to know? Oh, sorry. <laughs> Round the corner, so on the country road, there's a pub. It's got, it's boarded off, but it says for sale. So if we bought a pub, what happens? Can we live there? Can we live there? Yeah. Yeah. So it's like a house. Yeah, it can well, be. There's a house upstairs. How much are pubs? Yeah. <laughs> I mean, no, I'm, no, I'm, I'm not there. I'm not there. How much are pubs? All right. Tell me the name of the, what's the name of the place? No, no, no. The area. Amazing or amazing? Okay, there's one pub to, available to buy mm. in Harlow. Yeah. Um, oh. Well, might. no, this is in Hertfordshire, but we'll we'll go with the Hertfordshire one mm -hmm. just because it gives us an opportunity to complete. Oh no, there's. Oh wow, that's a good price. Um, this pub here it says is 145,000 pounds. Chip in. Hold on. So if we borrow 135 from the bank, we just put 10 grand down ourselves. I don't understand how this can be 145,000 pounds. There's a problem, there's a problem. There's an issue, but it says turnover available on request. Oh, there's no Oh no, it's a lease. It's a 145,000 pound lease. Oh, okay. What does that mean? It means you don't own it. So why is that, so what am I paying for? The what? Right, the right to do business there. 145,000 pounds for me to do business there. But you made that back. It's about oh. whether or not you make it back, yeah. You made that back. And um, I can live there, yeah? Yeah, there's, there's, there's always accommodation upstairs. There's some, in some ways, pubs good business, isn't it? are good business models, yeah. but in some ways they are bad business models. Boys, why is Weatherspoon open so early? They sell breakfast. But they sell beer. <laughs> I mean, people drink beer early. Nah, man. We need Richie Sunak. Well, yeah, yeah. We've that's mad. That's a, you know, that's a good point though, because even kebab shops. I've never seen the kebab shop open 9 a.m. Well, that's because no one buys kebabs at 9 a.m. No. But if you're gonna have beer, no, but chicken cottages. You open. might as well get kebab at nine a.m. Chicken cottages open at that time. Supply and demand is why most things happen in the world. Capitalism, pharmacy, and there is a big market for people to drink beer at nine a.m. I don't think you should sell beer until after the school run. It's a mess, like. So you're telling me kebab shops are not open, but yet <laughs> Mark <laughs> get hammered. <laughs> and William Hill is open at seven a.m. I think I want to say in I want to say that. Um, a lot of the time you can't buy alcohol. Yeah, you can, you can go in on Sundays, you can go in early, but you can't buy alcohol till 10 a.m. So you go to Web Spoons, get a breakfast and an orange juice, but you gotta wait till the clock ticks 10 a.m. But what do you think What do you think you're doing by holding it till 10? A lot. <laughs> I'm gonna be plastered by 11. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> <laughs> a lot of people, um, as part of their football routine as well. Okay, that makes sense. Go Spoons. Drink seven, seven pints, then head to the stadium. But today, I I, I, listen, I walked past the spoons today and it's international break. You hobbled past it. Yeah, I, I crutched past it. But it, like they're sitting outside like it's hot. Beers. Dazza goes on dates there. So. And they got carpet. Oh. I love it. I love I think I would be the first pub to have a um, marble floor. Weather spoons is class. The chips Ooh, is class. No, we'd, break, we'd break a lot of glasses. They do we? thick chips. I haven't been to Weatherspoons in a long time. I, the only one I used to go to was the one in Manchester because we used to stay there for work and go to the, get the breakfast because it's the last a great price. The last time I went to Weatherspoons was after Chucky's party. I was with Specs and a girl that said she went to school with UT, but she didn't. <laughs> she didn't <yeah. laughs> oh my God, we know him. Very good night. Yeah, is he vegetarian or not? <laughs> <laughs> Specs, can you show the crowd your screensaver? That photo is from a long time ago of Specs playing football. He's wow. just brought it back. I know what happened. And he is taking football seriously. I know what happened. You found it and you thought, I look, I look all right. Because you posted it. Boys, you're going to hear Stinker. Go on. I went to a men's game yesterday, yeah? yeah. Welcome. Keep going. I went as a goalkeeper. I was told by Sky Sports, you know, yeah, we like the goalkeeper stuff, but obviously, we're not gonna promote the tune here. Yeah. Rightly so, we've got to balance the box. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> You've got to balance the box. So, the content was about me meeting the best goalkeeper in WSL, Mary Earps. He's a big deal. Yeah, she's got a million followers on TikTok. Million is, she's a big deal. Okay. Yeah, Musoko as well, everything. 
class. So, she's been told that I'm coming to see her already. It was all prepared for after the game. Met her goalkeeping coach. <laughs> she was like, he was telling me that she's proud, you know, she's happy to see me. All was going well. Bear in mind, I'm diving all day. I've got mud all over me. Diving at Old Trafford. She has a stinker. The ball gets paid back to her. She gets pressed. She goes to kick it. it hits a striker and goes in. You know what that means. She ain't coming to see me. Yeah. However, they're playing against Man City. They, they, they lost 3-1. Mm. Man, Man City have City got- back a, in the title race. They're back in the title race, but they've got a black keeper. Mm. So, as you know, because I didn't want to balance the books, <laughs> I had no interest in speaking to this goalkeeper. Just, just because I bought the shoe, I've got to be loyal to me. <laughs> Alice, she's great, but I've got to be loyal to me, right T? <laughs> no. She had a great performance and she won. She gave me her shirt and I didn't get the interview with Mary Earps. You know what you got to do now, innit? So now, <laughs> <laughs> we did a remix of the tune. That's yeah. what I was going to say. Yeah. Yeah. White goalkeeper. <laughs> White goalkeepers. Oh, trash. <laughs> Dude, Jordy. Is it, is it not <laughs> a little bit like all goalkeepers are trash right now? Every go like, Even Alisson made a big mistake last well, year. Well, T, I've got to say, I can't say Asian goalkeepers. I've oh. got to say white. I don't know an Asian. Oh, I don't know an Asian goalkeeper. No, Efridge. Oh, yeah. Mm. Asia. Philippines. I don't think that's Asia. Oh, it's not Asia, what? is it? Let's get saying Asian. He's he's got different parts of his blood. He's oh, it is in Asia. It is in Asia. What did you say? I thought it was Pacific. I thought it was different. Oh, you thought it was like Samoan, then, man? Uh, yeah, I don't, I, the other side of the world, it's, it's it's hard to keep up. I messed up, man. I'm going down, by the way. When? Thursday. For how long? Till Sunday. No, I can't. I've, I've had a long weekend. I would love to. <laughs> <laughs> I, I didn't even invite him. <laughs> <laughs> no, I would have. No, but I, you know what? I would have. Okay, I would have hang around with you, but I'll hang around somewhere. I right, come. What, are you gonna come with me though? No, I'm not there. I'm not there. Have you been there before? I've been to the red one. Oh. Two? <laughs> Never. <laughs> it's, just, it's just me and you then. I remember. Um, <laughs> I remember. We, I think did we go to Amsterdam or did we go to France one time? What do you Steve? mean, Never? I saw you with Steve-O. <laughs> no, <laughs> we're in the shoot there. You sneak there. I saw you, T. I don't. Think, oh, we have we have worked in Amsterdam. You're right. Yeah. Was it, was it me and you, were we with us? We went to a restaurant and then someone was intent on going to the red light district. There was, and I, 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 no, you weren't there. This was 2016, because uh, Vincent was there. Oh, you're saying you, made it, you didn't make it yet? Yeah, you weren't, you weren't. <laughs> <laughs> I met no one called Vincent. <laughs> no, nah, that name is crazy. My son's got a, a friend called Vincent. I'm like, what, your, your name's Vincent, you're two. <laughs> <laughs> I know your parents say together. Because Vincent's worse. <laughs> Vincent is a strong old man name, you know. Vincent you Kennedy McMahon. Him, no, you can't call him Vincent, Vince, Vinny. Like these are big, big old man names. Vin. Frank. Vin. <laughs> Frank. Graham. Theodore. I said these names already, man. Theo. Yeah. Okay, Theo, but Theodore. Yeah, but. What the hell's the, Theo. what's the yo door for? <laughs> <laughs> Dimitri. That's a good <laughs> name. What's wrong with Dimitri? What? That's a Russian name. That's Dimitri is one of the worst names ever. Nah, Dimitri is cold. We're talking Russian. Your name needs to be Sasha. That's a great yeah. A Russian name Sasha is class. I know better Sasha. Isn't that um, Sasha Baron More like Yugoslavian Slavic Sasha. I don't know. I mean, my my son's got a um, friend in his uh, nursery called Sasha. I love him. Russian boys. I got a problem with my son. By the way, <laughs> he got bear problems. Yes. No, no. This I got a huge problem. My son He's is obsessed. Than your football. He's, he, so he's going to be a footballer, which is great. <laughs> which but is he's obsessed great. with the fighting scene in Mario. Mario versus Donkey Kong. Oh, yeah. yeah they yeah, fight on like, good scene, yeah. on a zip wire. Yeah. yeah. Class. And Mario ends up beating him up, yeah? Good seven minute fight. So now, that's what he knows now. Want to fight? Puts his fists up when he comes and he fights. Cool. He's a boy. That's what boys do. Mm. We'll go football now. Dribbling. Cones. He's in his kit. Good boy, Elias. Turn good. You want to fight <laughs> <laughs> while he's playing? T, remember this though. There's other parents there with their children. So everyone stops and looks at me and Elias. I'm trying to break up a fight between these dads. Because <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying to say, no, it's football, but he's hit me <laughs> in the ball bag. <laughs> so I've got to get him back. 
I, it can't be one nil to him. <laughs> does Elias, does Elias still act like um? Does he still act like Tigo's dog? He's changed. Is it? Completely different person now. Uh-huh. Completely different person. We're shocked. That's class. He's trying to be people's friends. Do you know? Do you know? I think though, because I like now I'm like wow. Like, it's because it's changed quickly. I think nurseries again. We can go through media. <laughs> <laughs> we can go through media, <laughs> or we can go and dig deep. They got a lift as well, yeah. I think they've got a lift and they clone these kids. Because how can this lorry driver come? He's not a lorry driver no more. He's playing football. He wants to fight. He's talking. <laughs> and he's, and he's, he's got a new thing as well now. When, if he throws his sister on the floor, I won. <laughs> what? <laughs> Does that raise Ramon? I'll call Podolsky now. Where the hell's he watching that from? I said, I said, I said if it's, if it's, if it's, who taught you this? I, I think it's Sasha that taught him that. I think it's sad. I don't know what Sasha's watching. <laughs> what kind of <laughs> Sasha's watching some Bruce Lee I film or something? Won. Yeah, and he's spitting, like actually spitting, and we have to break it down. No, you can't. Actually spitting. Yeah, I don't know where he's getting from, T. But again, conspiracy. Oh, speaking of spitting, by the way, I want to see my granddad. <laughs> oh yeah, that's what we do, Africans. <laughs> Let me land. Let me land. <laughs> <laughs> Let me land. Let me land. <laughs> <laughs> What's going on? Let me land. Hey, the granddad coming home from a pistol, you man. Oh my god. My granddad's <laughs> my granddad's old as hell. I think he's I think he's ninety this year. Or ninety no ninety five, whatever. He's in our he's in a home in East. Went to see him. My mom this is before I, I was knocking on heaven's door. My mom's like, uh Dad, you alright? Yeah. He can't see. He can't see. He don't know who he's oh, talking okay. to. Yeah. You look thirsty, take some water. Okay. Drinks the water. Triple H. Triple H. <laughs> my mum's <laughs> in the house. My mum's flabbergasted. <laughs> oh, your, your, I love your mum, you know, British. <laughs> British, my parents would be like, don't spit back. <laughs> don't spit back, whatever you do, don't spit back. Cause you know me, I'm, it's not one nil. <laughs> if you're going to, oh, bub, I was, oh, vomit on it, man. I told her, mum. I'll be honest, we should just cut. He don't know who we are. She hit, she hit me. She hit him? No, me. <laughs> <laughs> Elderly abuse. <laughs> Your mum would have been a, co- a cockney now. <laughs> you hit my granddad, man. Granddad's looking at me. Dad, do you remember who that is? Yeah. Who is that? Who is that? I said, come on, let's go. <laughs> <laughs> let's just go. <laughs> when they, when, this is when they start repeating, T, <laughs> the machine's off. <laughs> Seriously, T, it's, it's time to go. Oh, my days. Oh, mate. How does this story end? <laughs> oh, no, I told I said, let's go. I'm rushing. I'm like, mum, let's leave. Let's like. That's her dad, you know. I know it is. It's my granddad, too, I'll be honest. My granddad. When did he, when did he, when did he lose his, fa- when did he lose his faculties? Oh my God, this is, do you know what? It's slowly been going for like five years. He always used to go missing. You believe him? All right, I swear to God, yeah. One day I was scrolling on the timeline and um, met police, missing person, my granddad's face. What? Have you seen this man last seen in Westminster? Did you DM Specs to share why it? Why is he in Westminster? Why? Did he pose up? He said, I went for, a, I was looking, he was looking for the toilet, he said. Left his house, went to Westminster. And he's, he's, he said he's, he said his white, his white friends brought him home and the white friends are the police. <laughs> and that's when we said, all right, cool, it's time. Alzheimer's is crazy. It's something that we shouldn't laugh at at all. Yeah, Specs, put your top down, man. Stop laughing. <laughs> we got my granddad, though. But it's funny because it those Specs' white friends are police as well, by the I'm way. Not, uh, <laughs> <laughs> I'm not laughing at the actual thing. I'm laughing at the fact that he went to the toilet. But end up in Westminster. Surely, when you're on a bus team <laughs> and it's some of that bus stops, you're not going to see a toilet. Granddad, come on. T, come on. They're acting, man. On that note of medical updates, uh, Specs is going to the dentist. Finally. Yeah, man. Tomorrow morning, I'm keeping Are you again? Keeps yeah. getting this half hour surgery. He won't get the proper surgery to fix it properly. He'll just keep getting those stop gaps. Come on, be a man. Well, no rule show. Geordie's back from the stairs. I'm alive, man. Bex is on his way to the dentist. Who knows if he'll survive those stairs? Just, but what's, what's that uh, podcast called? Drinks? Something? Drinks? Drink champs. Drink champs. I hate this when they yeah, all do this. Yeah, let's get the let's, worst Let's part. make some noise for that. <laughs> Everyone's clapping, looking at each other. 
Subscribe to the channel if you are listening on Spotify. Subscribe to us on Spotify. If you're not listening to us on Spotify, give it a go. Who saw Hassan Campbell?